Junie Tony Story Musical, The Emperor's New Clothes. Shall we start? Once upon a time, there lived an emperor who liked to dress up. No, no, not this one, no! I have nothing to wear. The emperor was not interested in taking care of the people. He only cared about what he would wear every day. Hmm. Are there any special clothes? The special clothes only for your majesty. Please leave it to us. Hello, everyone. We're terrific designers. Want some special clothes, your majesty? Please leave it to us. <laughs> We're terrific designers. There are no clothes that we can't make. One and only. Special clothes? That's no problem. Gold and silver thread. Gold and silver thread. Sapphire and ruby. Sapphire and ruby. Shiny, shiny, and the best clothes in the world. Leave it, leave it, leave it to us. Special clothes? That's no problem. Only the nice people. Only the nice people. Can see the clothes. Can see the clothes. Shiny, shiny, and the best clothes in the world. Leave it, leave it, leave it to us. Your Majesty. <laughs> oh, listen. Bring them whatever they need. Yes, sir. The brothers spent days playing and eating. <laughs> Who would have thought he'd fall for such a lie? <laughs> I know. We're rich now. <laughs> and then when someone came, they sat at an empty loom, pretending to be weaving. They pretended to sew with a threadless needle. The king sent me to see what the clothes were like. You came at the right time. We're about to finish the clothes. The two brothers presented a mannequin. Huh? Uh, I don't see anything. What do you think? Only the nice people can see them. Aren't they beautiful? The cloth is made of gold thread and the sleeves are embroidered with silver thread and there are jewel buttons on the chest. Oh, I see. Oh, what great work. <laughs> the servant lied because he was afraid that the emperor might think he was bad. It was so beautiful. I'm sure you would love it too, your majesty. Oh, are you sure? Then I'll have to march tomorrow. I'll show my people how beautiful my clothes are. Ye yes of course, your majesty. Everyone will look up to you. The next day, the emperor was very confused when he went to see the clothes made by the two brothers. Oh, there is nothing. Or is it just me who can't see it? The servants couldn't see the clothes either. But they pretended to see the clothes. Whoa, whoa, it's wonderful. I, I think so too. It would look so good on you, your majesty. The emperor pretended he could see the clothes. <clears throat> You are very good at this. I'll make sure you will get paid enough. Thank you, Your Majesty. <laughs> the Emperor's march had begun. The people who came out to watch him were surprised to see the naked Emperor. When no one was able to say anything, a child laughed and shouted. <laughs> Look at him! The king is naked! Haha, <laughs> Look at him! The naked emperor! N-A-K-E-D! The naked emperor! Wearing only underwear! Proudly he marches! Haha, <laughs> The naked emperor! <laughs> hmm, he's right! Actually, I can't see it either! Me neither! Me neither! Ha 
Aha, look at him, the naked emperor. N-A-K-E-D, the naked emperor. Wearing only underwear, proudly he marches. The Emperor's face turned red, and he hurried back to the castle. <laughs> Junie Tony Story Musical. See you next time!